Hey everybody, it's Sean. I'm here with my good friend, Dr. Newsom. What's up, bro? Hey, man. <laughs> we go way back, you guys. It's been a while. It's been several years. And so I want to talk a little bit about the endocannabinoid system. I want to talk about our whole flower CBD fluid, which you've been familiar with Excellent. for years, Excellent. our plant enzymes. But I want to talk about, there's something happening. And I want to hear from you. You guys, this is the first time I'm going to hear this. Here's what's going on. So you know we've been working with plant enzymes forever, and we have great success, right? And our whole flower CBD fluid, right? Which is super right. unique, tons of success. Excellent. But we're getting insane testimonials when people are using both our plant enzymes and our whole flower CBD fluid. Now, what does that do, like with the endocannabinoid system, our receptors? Right, right. Can you just, man, help me understand even better how all this is working. Why is it working so right. good? Well, here's, here's the thing, your endocannabinoid system, yeah, okay. uh, just to give you an idea of what your endocannabinoid system does, is it, it, it connects your hormonal system to your nervous system, okay. yeah. Yeah. and connects those to your immune system. Yeah. All yeah. right, so you get these three super important right. systems, this is all your body's communication systems, okay? Well, those communication systems need their own communication system. Okay. Okay. So yes. this endocannabinoid system is the is that intercommunication system. You know, the communication system within the within the communication system. system. Okay. okay. I got you. All right. All right. So, so to get, just to give you that concept. Now, the health of your endocannabinoid system is going to be extremely dependent. Of your microbiome. You got it. Okay. okay. So a healthy microbiome feeds and keeps or maintains, upkeeps, okay, yeah, yeah. a healthy endocannabinoid system. Okay, wait, well, I'm, I'm gonna break you down for a second. Just in case some of our viewers aren't that savvy <laughs> your microbiome. microbiome. Let's talk about that. Just for yes, a minute. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, microbiome, microbiome, okay. So your entire digestive tract, think of it as a 30 foot long tube, okay? On the inside of that tube, there is a membrane called the mucous membrane. And inside that membrane, there are colonies and colonies and colonies, and millions of colonies of, of microbes, or bacteria and fungus. What's what yeah. it is that colonize those, that your, their whole yeah. digestive tract. Whether or not that is colonized by healthy bacteria and fungus right. or unhealthy bacteria and fungus determines whether or not you're healthy or not. It just starts there. It all just starts there, yep. right. So, okay. so when you're adding enzymes into the system, especially if you back the enzymes up with probiotics. Yeah, okay. It's us. Right. Right. We do that. We like <laughs> yeah. to do that. Right. Okay. When you do that, that is enhancing all the good aspects of that microbiome. Okay. 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 So that's super important. So as that's happening, as you're taking these enzymes, you're taking these probiotics, right? You're fortifying the good aspects of your your microbiome. Yes. Okay. Now, CBDs, especially if you take them orally. Yeah. Okay. This is why it's it's actually detrimental to smoke it. You need to be consuming it. To help your gut, your gut, right? You want to help your gut. Right. It's extremely helpful. Okay, so CBDs are like superfood for the good microbes. Okay? okay, so those good, the good bugs love CBD. Right on. But CBD is real similar to, uh, let's say, thyroid hormones for someone that has an underactive thyroid. Okay. Insulin for somebody that's a diabetic, okay, when okay. they don't have enough of yeah. those of those hormones, they got to take those hormones from someplace else, right? right? Right. So when you when you consume CBD, it goes into that endocannabinoid system and activates it just like somebody that if they had a, a you know a thyroid that wasn't right, right, they start taking the thyroid hormones, well their body starts getting activated again, right? Because you corrected that deficiency. Okay, but when you are combining things like adaptogens and enzymes and probiotics okay. with the CBDs, 
okay, you're feeding the endocannabinoid system from one side, but you're supplementing it with the CBDs on the other side. Gotcha. Okay, so your effect, the one just is gonna amplify the other. It's gonna amplify the other, and so really, so as far as these receptors, right. these, these little, like we like to say, these little locks where we're, we're putting the key in, right? Right. We're filling those receptors. Right. It, it just seems to happen. Right. It's like it's like the success with our enzymes happens even faster, faster, it's happen faster with our right. whole flower CBD fluid. Right. Right. Does that make right. sense? I That's mean, it's exactly just, it. It, it, That's exactly it. At first, we kept hearing all these different people. Oh, this is happening, and this is happening. Like, well, that used to happen, well, but it's happening way faster now. Of course. And of course. the only difference was. With our what we've been doing with these full spectrum plant enzymes, stabilized probiotics, you know, we've always done that together, right. and right. now we've added this CBD whole flower fluid. It's like, holy cow, man! What right? Sandwiching it, okay? Sandwiching it. So you're supporting it on one side, and supplementing it on the other side, okay? Does that makes sense because those are different. Yeah, those are supporting different. something is is in, you know enabling it, yeah, and, and promoting it. Uh, Trying to get some, you're trying to get the baby to walk on its own two feet. Right. Know? Okay. Right. Right. Yeah. Okay. Versus supplementing it, you know, that's you know, giving them wheels. <laughs> you know. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Absolutely. I mean? So, so it's different, and so those are those are, uh, oh, that's the effect that you're getting. You're getting support so, on one side and supplementing on the other. So really, when we just when we talk about this endocannabinoid system or these receptors, right? There's a couple main receptors that we're, right. we're talking about, and then they're saying there's a third one that potentially is, is being researched and discovered. Can you just talk a little bit about that? Like, it's like the body is balancing out. Hormones seem to be balancing out. The homeostasis that we're all right. seeking really seems to come into play. Right. How, how do you describe this <laughs> endocannabinoid the, system? The system I, I like to describe it as a communication system. Communication you know, system. It's a communication. It helps. It's a secondary regulation system. Okay. So your your hormones. Um, if you include neurotransmitters as hormones, yeah. okay, like your dopamine and serotonin, uh, hormones control one hundred percent of the metabolic functions of the body. One hundred percent. Okay. Um, enzymes. Okay. All right. Uh, this is this is really kind of cool. Think of this, enzymes are like dominoes. Okay. Okay, so one domino gets started and it, it hits the next one, hits the next one, hits the next yeah. one, right? Yeah. So enzymes start those, start, they, they push the first They start domino. that process. Yes. Exactly. They're the catalyst. Exactly. They're the catalyst, yeah. right? Okay, so I'll give you an example. Your, your heart, okay? In order for your heart to beat one time, it goes through 60, I'm sorry, 86 enzymatic reactions, or cascade of enzymes. Yeah. So it's yeah. 86 dominoes, okay, have to fall in order for your heart to beat one time. It's just the heart, just the heart, that's just your heart, okay? Your liver filters every drop of blood in your body every three minutes, okay? There's 65,000 enzymatic what? reactions that go on inside your three. Man, I, I knew that was a big number. I forgot how big that number was. <laughs> it's huge. <laughs> it's huge. It's huge. So yeah. 65,000 yeah. dominoes right on. fall in three minutes to clean off your, all the blood in your body. Right. And that's every three minutes. That's crazy. Man, clean blood is... And it's, I mean, we won't even go there. to have clean blood. blood you know? The key. It is. It is. So, so that, that's what enzymes do. Yeah. Okay. So in our body, now that's not even, we're talking about systemic enzymes, that's not even, the digestive enzymes. Right. Okay, digestive enzymes take your, your plate full of food. Right. Right. Okay. I've seen you eat. Right, right. That's <laughs> a bigger plate. plate full of food. <laughs> <laughs> All right, keep going. So you're, they take your plate full of food and break those compound, yeah. compounds, right? <laughs> into microscopic individual nutrients okay and if if you don't have those enzymes in your gut you're gonna have to get them from somewhere right okay and what happens is those enzymes in your gut if they're not present your body isn't producing them in the gut 
they're going to have to steal enzymes from other right. places. They're going to have right. to steal inventory from other places right. to keep the supply going. Exactly. I got it, right? So, um, so when you're taking CBDs, which are enhancing, they're supplementing that okay. regulatory system, the secondary regulatory system. Okay, so it's keeping your nervous system, hormonal system, in your nerve, in your immune system. Yeah. Okay. Immune system. All yeah. communicating. Okay. So think about this: your immune system communicates with your nervous system and your hormonal system. Okay, letting your nervous system and hormonal system know what's going on in the environment around you yeah. and what's going on in the environment inside you, right? Okay, Very cool. so there's all kinds of communication yes. going on. And so if those lines of communication break down, <laughs> you got issues. You got issues. You're yeah. gonna get sick, period. Yeah. yeah. Period. And who knows what that's gonna look like. Right. Okay, because I mean, a, a million things can go wrong, right? So. What CBD is doing is it is reconnecting those systems, right. so they have proper communication. So when you're doing that, right, you're doing something right, enhancing right. your gut. I mean, my gosh. Well, because it, it, we're so depleted these CBDs because we didn't know, we didn't know, right? We, we, so we're, it's like our body's yearning. These receptors are starving, and I think that's why some people notice things like right away. We're all different. We're the same, but we're different. But it's been forever that we've really been really focusing on feeding these you know, receptors. Right. You know, generations have passed since we've been we've had access to this. Right. You know, which is terrible. Generation think, to generation, now we're we look and we see where we are from the gut, from right. enzymes, right? What, what, what we're starting life with, what the little ones are starting life with. But certainly these CBDs, man, I mean, who knew? Right, you know, and, and so the, the enzymes, you know, we, we talked about the research, you know, back in the 1930s and whatnot, and, and then I think they kind of discovered the, the CBD scenario around the 19, around 1940-ish, 1964, you know, in Israel, they really started to just really take things to the next level, and then over the last even couple decades, this endocannabinoid system, it's just fascinating. You guys, to me, it's mind-boggling, I mean, Doc, I mean, for you, I mean, this guy's super cool. If you guys don't know him, I mean, you were like the, is it the youngest doctor of natural health or what? Yeah, I was the uh, youngest uh, licensed naturopathic physician in the history of the United States. What? That's kind of big. It's kind of a big deal at what age? 20 years old. 20? Yeah. All right. Let me think what I was doing. In I think I was playing like college football or something, <laughs> running around <laughs> right. radio games and stuff like that when I was 20. But anyways, okay. So this guy knows a little bit. It's so fun when I watch you and Tylene get together and geek out. <laughs> you guys, most of the time I just leave the room because it's just like, like okay, I can't even, it's, just more, it's either going over here or over there. I'm like, all right, enough of this stuff. But what I love about you, what I love about Tylene when it comes to sharing this information is that you guys break this down for someone like myself to grasp. And you know, over the past 20 years now, I've obviously I, I know a lot, right? You just, all kinds of I've stuff. absorbed a lot. You know, my food's <laughs> absorbing and, and my nutrients are absorbing and, and I'm absorbing all this information. And I think it's important that all of us realize, you know, we're on this crusade, man. We're on this mission to educate super healthy lifestyle. And really right now, so important to us, the C V D whole flour fluid, we're not dealing or working with an oil and it's the unicorn. Right. And so we sure. you guys we're gonna make more of these videos, I think, as we hang out and do some things and we're, we're, we're grateful that you just took a few minutes. We sure. always, you know, we're up here visiting and hanging out, but is there anything else you want to add or, or when it comes to CBD or endocannabinoid system that you think we're, we're missing? Well, here's a, when your, your regulatory mechanisms aren't operating, you know, <laughs> you got a little noise here, it's all good. It's a little noise with the video, it's cool. So when you're, Keeping it real. <laughs> you know, when your regulatory mechanisms aren't operating properly, things start getting out of hand. Yeah. I mean, it's just, it's just, I mean, it's like having kids. You know, like, if you're not regulating the kids, things get out of hand. Nah. Right? <laughs> just a little bit. Just a little bit. Whoa. Yeah. You know? So the same thing goes on in our body in, in it, that, you know, your nervous system will try to keep things regulated. Your hormones will try to regulate everything immune system will try to regulate everything 
but when they get off kilter and they're each individually trying to regulate everything and they're not coordinating that effort, it's, you know, it's like herding cats. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's, yeah. It really yeah. is. It's like herding cats. Your body just can't right. regulate itself, you know? And that's, and from a clinical standpoint, I, this is, well, I see this every day, all day long. You know, everybody comes in, by the time right. they see me, they got things going so got issues everywhere. You got issues. Exactly. So much easier to prevent right. than for them to have to come oh to gosh. you or to tie lean yes. and help right. get the body back. Right. You know, absolutely. Are you as excited as we are about? I mean, seriously. Oh, for sure. Uh, like with the farm bill, um, with the CBD, and, and you, you know, not everyone knows about our whole flower fluid. Right. You do. You knew about it early on right. years ago, and, and I know you had some great experiences with that. And we did some things, whether it was in the U.S. or other countries. Oh, other countries. You know, because we kind of had to do that for right. a while. But I mean, are you? Because man, we're we're super I've, excited. But but I want to know from your perspective how you see it. I've had. Patients dealing with issues like Crohn's disease. Crohn's? Yeah. I've had patients with autism. Oh, yeah. Autism. Yeah. With Parkinson's. Yeah. Uh, it's my favorite remedy for restless leg. <laughs> Woo! Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It, it's, you know? yeah. I got gotcha. you. <laughs> you know, it's my favorite remedy. I mean, nothing works like this. Man, you know? In, you know, my patients you know, with, you know, severe digestive issues like Crohn's or yeah. other things yeah. like that, you know, when, you know, they go into the bathroom 20 times a day and half the time they're bleeding every time they go to the bathroom. Mm -hmm. And they start taking something like this and all of a sudden, you know, day two, three later, it's, they're it's, like, Doc, what the heck is this stuff? You know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, there's so many things. I was just with someone today, super nauseous. Mm -hmm. This individual was really nauseous. And, uh, Give her a little bit of the whole flower fluid. I'm talking about gone. like fast. Right, it was right. gone. Like, She's like, what did you give that. me? What was that? <laughs> Why don't? How do, How did that do that? I'm like, I don't know. How to, you know, it's like I don't want to get into all the all the all the craziness about it that goes behind it. And she goes, I really don't care. How do I get that? Right, right. Just kind of funny. Where do I get? This because place? we're we're not used to that. I think sometimes. Sure. And, and so, anyways, but. We're, we're, we're grateful for you. We're grateful for our, our good partner and friend uh, who created this, this process okay. to create Excellent. this whole flower fluid that, you know, he, he did find the unicorn out there. And, right. and we need, you know, folks like yourself that are highly educated. You have a gazillion, I don't even do too many degrees and certifications. <laughs> I, I mean, they wouldn't fit in this video. I wonder if we could just scroll them all, we maybe. In the thing instead of I do one of those like cartoon. Yeah, <laughs> it's it's got kind of, it's not even funny anyway. So it's crazy, but it's great to have your voice. We need your voice, man. We need everyone. We need your voice. We need everyday common folk like me. I'm just just and a, me and Ty. We just Ty. you know we don't you know you're just nutty. You're off the <laughs> charts. But all of us, we need to do this together collectively because there's power in numbers. Absolutely. There's power in information. And then taking that education and that information and not only sharing it, but applying, applying it, it, doing something with it, take those first steps. You know, I highly recommend plant enzymes where, where you, know, you use right, them. Right. And of course, the whole flower CBD fluid. So you guys, we'll talk to you again real soon. We got to go. You may be hungry again. Huh? Yeah. This guy gets hungry a little <laughs> bit. Plate of food right now. Yeah, just a little bit. <laughs> All right. You guys have a great night. Thanks again, man. Peace.